Oh, beautiful. Oh. Absolutely beautiful. Lionel Messi strikes in 22 and Stanislav Chakarov has the lead. What's up my friends, Wikipedia here and today I will show you the best tactics for the 5th variation of 4-3-3 after the patch but before we jump to the tutorial, if my lessons are helpful for you and if you want even more FIFA 16 content on my channel then smash the like button and subscribe for my channel. Now it's time for the main part, have fun! You will find our formation as 4-3-3 when you're playing the normal mode of the game. We will apply stay back while attacking and normal interceptions to all of our defenders and like that they will stand on their original positions. For our central mid we will put stay back while attacking and aggressive interceptions. With those settings he will try to help always to our defenders but you have to choose someone with a good stamina otherwise you will be forced to change him around minute 65. But for the left and right midfielders we will use a bit different instructions and we will put only aggressive interceptions because with that formation we don't need to make them to stay back while we are attacking. We don't need to change anything for our left and right forwards and here we will play with the default player instructions. And of course we will use getting behind for our ST like that he will make as much as possible runs behind our opponent's defenders every time when we are attacking. Let's move on and let's talk about the best possible custom tactic. Here we have 3 attackers and 3 midfielders so we don't need more than 60 on speed, passing is 50 for a mixed style of passes and the positioning is organized, otherwise if you use the free form option here you will have a lot of problems because your defenders will not stand on their positions and they will make really stupid runs. You know that I'm always using the same numbers on chance creation for all custom tactics but if you're new watching my tutorials for first time and don't know why then check the first link in the description. On pressure we will put 35 and like that your defenders will not be so deep and near to the goalkeeper but at the same time they will not stand far away from him. For aggression we will use again 80, you know that after the patch this is the perfect number because like that your players will be more aggressive and much better when there are interceptions. The team width is 50 because with that formation your players are positioned pretty balanced on the pitch and we don't need to change that number. And the defender line is covered like that you have good and stable defense and also there won't be any gaps between your defenders. That was my FIFA 16 formation review about the 5th variation of 4-3-3 after the patch. I hope that after watching this tutorial you will improve a lot your gameplay with that formation. But still if you have any questions or requests write your comments down below. For more FIFA 16 gameplay tutorials, ultimate team gameplay, squad builders and more and more destroy the like button and subscribe for my channel. Team Wiki is waiting for you. My name is Taz, thank you for watching my friends, bye bye.